Hey, good morning, YouTubers. This is Goose, and I'm coming live from Goose TV uh, in Southport, North Carolina. What I forgot to tell you all is that uh, I will be relocating from Fishers, Indiana uh, to Southport, North Carolina on February 28th of this year. So my, uh, my hike is scheduled to commence on April 1st. Uh, my wife and I, my wife Barbara and I are moving from uh, Fishers, Indiana to Southport, North Carolina, because this is the place we're going to look to retire. Um, so we have the pack and move that's uh, scheduled to happen on the 28th. We'll be down here at the beginning of March, and uh, I will be getting ready to uh, build a new home, a retirement home down here in Southport, North Carolina, and uh, at the same time getting ready to go on the trail on April 1st. So uh, life is pretty busy, 52 days ago now. And uh, I've uh, posted some things uh, recently on Facebook with regards to my, my backpack. Uh, my backpack has a weight of uh, 43.22 pounds. The consumables within that is uh, 13.77. The consumables being uh, my water, my fuel, and my food. So I have a base weight around 29.55 pounds. So I've asked some feedback on uh, Facebook with regards to that. If anyone has a more feedback that they'd like to give me, uh, please give me some information in, in the notes section here uh, so I can really kind of uh, get to, to where I think I need to be. Feels pretty comfortable. I've taken a couple of walks and uh, I think that uh, I'll be okay. But uh, obviously uh, some of the feedback that initially I've gotten is that uh, I'll work that out as my uh, as it goes along. This, this particular YouTube is gonna focus on a couple of different things. I'm gonna show everybody the, uh, the information uh, or the, the stuff that I'm really packing away. Uh, we're gonna talk a little bit about uh, uh, the AT Passport, uh, the AT uh, Guide. Uh, I, I purchased both of those. Uh, the guide has been uh, outstanding. Uh, There's a litany of information. Uh, I have gut hooks uh, as my application. I've been playing around with that and uh, it seems like uh, I have everything I need uh, with regards to going on the trail. Uh, the last thing that uh, I make a strong recommendation for uh, is a book that uh, that I purchased uh, that I'm just about uh, finished with, and uh, that's A Wall on the Appalachian Trail uh, by David Miller. Uh, it's just an outstanding read uh, for those that uh, maybe are new to the AT through hike. Uh, he really gives a, a a great overview of the trials and tribulations that he went through on that particular hike. And uh, I've uh, found it rather amazing uh, as I've gotten about three quarters into that book. I expect to have it finished by the time I get onto the, uh, onto the trail. So with that, I'm gonna, I'm gonna really kind of fast forward. Uh, we're gonna look to have uh, some of the information kind of reviewed what I have being put into my pack. Um, I've given you the weight and, and, and whatnot. And then at the end, I'm gonna make that uh, that strong suggestion to really subscribe uh, to this particular channel. Um, I am hiking for uh, a great cause. Uh, there's two charities that I'm involved with, uh, Learn to Cope out of uh, Taunton, Massachusetts, uh, and then Walk by Faith uh, that's located in New City, uh, New York. Both of those organizations are really involved with uh, trying to help with the opioid epidemic um, that uh, plagues uh, currently the United States. Uh, some of my earlier videos, uh, you may have seen uh, what I'm trying to do. And uh, I certainly appreciate any and all support that I can get uh, as I begin uh, this uh, lifetime challenge I have in front of me uh, beginning on April 1st. So with that, uh, Goose is going to sign off and uh, give you some information as you move forward. Thanks, folks.
that's going to bring us to the conclusion of uh, episode number two for uh, Goose and uh, hiking the AT 2020. So tagline is going to be follow the goose. Uh, before I go here, one last uh, one last attempt, really. Uh, I have a GoFundMe page that uh, is in place. Uh, it really kind of is designed to support the two agencies that I talked to you all about with regards to opioid uh, addiction and what we're trying to do to support uh, really kind of a putting an end to this epidemic that we see in the domestic United States. So uh, if you're interested in participating in that, uh, the information is going to be in the description that's listed below. Uh, and uh, it's a GoFundMe page that I put in place to try to uh, get all funds that are, that are, that are generated uh, really kind of sent to these agencies uh, as I progress on this particular trail. Uh, to those that have uh, participated thus far, I, I just want to really kind of sincerely thank you for everything you've done up to this particular point. Uh, it's not necessary at all to to uh, to to really kind of contribute anything. Uh, I'd ask that you please consider subscribing and provide any type of support for me as I, I know I will need it as I move through this particular journey. Uh, so with that, uh, this is Goose signing off from uh, Goose TV and have a Goose Day. Thanks. Really, thank you for everything you've done up to this particular point. Uh, it's not necessary at all to to uh, to to really kind of contribute anything. Uh, I'd ask that you please consider subscribing and provide any type of support for me as I I know I will need it as I move through this particular journey. Uh, so with that, uh, this is Goose signing off from uh, Goose TV, and have a Goose Day. Thanks.